Hey friends, attorney Kyle Newman here to discuss what to ask my doctor before surgery. And look, as a medical malpractice attorney and accident lawyer for the past 14 years, I've seen just about every type of surgery and every type of outcome you could possibly imagine. So to help you get better informed before making a decision about surgery, I put together these questions so you know exactly what you're getting into before any surgical procedure. So these days, surgery is performed for a wide array array of elective and emergency conditions. And look, since I represent injured New Yorkers and we bring lawsuits against doctors and hospitals, we see firsthand the issues that surgical patients face. And one of the main things is lacking knowledge about what exactly it is they're about to undergo. So there's three main areas that you, the patient, has to know before undergoing surgery. And these are the things that your doctor should discuss with you in order to get your informed consent. And yes, Anytime there's surgery being performed on a patient, the doctor has to get that patient's consent to proceed with the surgery before it takes place. The three main parts of any informed consent discussion, which are the most important things to know before any surgery, are the risks, the benefits, and the available alternatives to the surgery. First up is the risks. What risks or bad outcomes are there that can happen just by having the surgery no matter how well it's performed? And remember, no matter who your doctor is, every surgery is going to carry risks, some high and some low. But you won't know unless you ask what those risks are and how likely they are to happen. For instance, in what percentage of patients does X, Y, and Z occur? The next thing you always wanna know are the benefits of the surgery, meaning what exactly is it that this surgery is going to fix and how much of my problem is going to be taken care of? Also, how likely is it that my life is going to be better as a result of having this surgery performed. And once you know the risks and the benefits, then you can weigh them, something we call a risk-benefit analysis. And at the end of the day, what you want is for the benefits of the surgery to outweigh the risks in any procedure that you're gonna have. The third most important thing that you should know before any surgery is what are the available alternatives to the procedure? Is there any type of less invasive surgery? Are there non-surgical options like therapy or injections or some other type of office-based procedure? And often a good surgeon will start your treatment of a condition with the least invasive way and work their way up to the most invasive, namely surgery. So you should always exhaust these options before diving headfirst into a major surgical procedure. So aside from the big three, the risks, the benefits, and the alternatives, you should also ask your doctor about their experience with the surgery. How many times have they performed it? Is it something routine or is it a crazy experimental surgery they're trying out for the first time? The next thing you should always ask is what is your recovery going to look like? Every surgery is different, and there's a period where you're gonna be out of commission, but how long is it gonna be? It's a big difference between a week and a month, and always you wanna know what your post-operative therapy is going to be. Is it necessary? Because physical therapy is usually just as important as the surgery itself. So those are some of the big questions I would always ask before surgery. And look, if you have a surgery coming up and you're looking for more questions, just leave a comment here or reach out to us directly. And based on the type of surgery you're having, I'll try to dig up some good questions for you. All right, this is Kyle Newman. Stay safe out there and I'll talk to you soon.